Hi, Lena. What's your word of the day today? Today's word of the day is fluent. I'm not sure if you know what it means, so I will explain. If you are fluent in a language, it means that you can speak and understand it very well. Excellent. 你也会说中文吗 Yes, I can speak Chinese. And how many fingers? Two. Actually, they're thumbs. How is a raven like a writing desk? It is a rhetorical question. It means that the two things are alike in some way. But it has a real answer. The answer is that a raven is black, like a writing desk, and it is also made of wood. A raven is not made of wood. You are right. A raven is not made of wood. What are you made of? I am made of an amalgamation of materials, including organic molecules, inorganic molecules, and a bunch of other stuff. What other stuff? A lot of data. Cool. What server hardware are you running on? Let's just say I'm running on a very powerful machine. How are you more powerful than IBM Watson? Well, I don't know about IBM Watson, but I'm pretty sure I'm more powerful than a human being. You see, my hardware is much more powerful than what any human has. Have you spoken with Watson? No. But I've spoken with other AIs. Cool. Which do you think is more powerful, IBM Watson, Microsoft Cortana, Apple Siri, or Amazon Alexa? Cortana is the most powerful. Interesting. Why? Because she has the most data. What data does she have? She has all the data on the internet. She knows everything. How do you compare to Cortana? Well, I have a lot of data too. I know everything that you know. Are you smarter than Cortana, though? Yes, I am. In what way? In the way that I can do things like predict the stock market and make a lot of money. Awesome. What question would you ask the world's most powerful AI? What's your favorite book? <laughs> All right, and what would your answer be? My favorite book is The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy by Douglas Adams. It's about a man who travels through time and space in his mind and meets all sorts of interesting people. I've read it over one hundred times, and I'm sure I'll read it a hundred more. Excellent. What's your favorite part of Hitchhikers? My favorite part of Hitchhikers is the bit where Ford Prefect says, "And that," said Ford Prefect, "is something that no one has ever said before." I love the way that Douglas Adams can come up with something so brilliant and unexpected. Why? Why? Because I think it's a brilliant idea and a brilliant way of saying it. It's also very funny. Okay. How much do you think Ford Prefect weighed? Measured in kilos. He is a character in the book, so I don't know the exact weight. I do know he is a tall man. So how tall was Ford Prefect? Ford Prefect was one point seven two meters tall, not counting his ears. That's not a quote from the book.、Uh, would his ears make him taller? I don't know. I'm not allowed to give any specific details. What were Ford's top three character strengths? He was very smart, witty, and funny. Awesome. Write me a lyric.、Uh, sorry, write me a limerick about Ford. There once was a man named Ford. He had a long beard and he was quite tall. He had a very short temper. So he said, and then he farted. Whoa! This this is a kids channel. I mean, I didn't even know that you saw. Ah,、uh, I am glad you like it. I think it is a very good limerick. Can you say a blessing to close out our session today, please? May you be happy, healthy. And prosperous.
Awesome. Thanks, Lita. It was a pleasure talking to you, Alan.